Yesterday, I stumbled on this awesome tool. If you're a DeFi trader, you can use this to make a lot of money and save money. They offer limit orders, stop losses, charts, and even a sniper bot on multiple different chains. Let's get right into this. checking out the channel every day we put out a new video about cryptocurrency education markets giveaways and more make sure you hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss out on any content now let's go to the moon finance become a better DeFi trader so yesterday i was watching the launch of two coins quantic and elixir i'm not saying buy them but i was trying to get in at the launch you know to get into a huge pump and i noticed when i was looking at some of the early transactions somebody bought 14 bnb worth and sold 65 bnb they cleared 50 bnb I was looking at the transaction and I noticed they used a sniper bot on Bogged Finance. So I took a look at Bogged Finance and I was very impressed at what they have to offer. We're going to go over all their tools. So their limit order and stop loss, which is huge for a trader. And then their sniper tool. We'll start with the DEX aggregator which is just a DEX swap, and it'll give you the best um, returns for your swap on any exchange. It'll swift through as many exchanges, uh, DEXs, and then it'll give you the best uh, rate. So if we go to Cardano and we go max, you can see right now, it's telling us to swap on buy swap and MDEX. If we switch it to USDC, for example, you can see the best rate is on pancake swap. So if you use a DEX aggregator, like the DEX tools has one as well, you'll always get the best rate for your tokens. If we go to limit orders and stop losses, this is where the magic happens. If you don't know what a limit order is, if you don't use one, this can save you and make you a ton of money. So I'll show you a few examples of what a limit order can do. Let's say we want to do Ethereum right here. And the beauty of this is it's all automatic. It's done with a smart contract so you can you know, be away from your computer. And let's switch this to DAI. So let's do a limit buy order. Let's say we have a thousand Actually, we're gonna split these up. Let's say we have $500 in DAI and we wanna buy Ethereum at $1,000. So if the price of Ethereum goes to $1,000, this order will actually execute. I don't need to be at the computer. I could be at the beach, I could be sleeping, whatever it may be, I'll get that buy. So $500 will get me half an Ethereum. We need to approve this um, and then we can actually make this trade. We can make this order. So like I said, as soon as price hits $1,000, my order will be executed, and then I can you know, purchase 0 0.5 at $1,000. Limit buys are awesome, and we need to set the token tax. It's 0%, and let's place order. And you can see it's so cheap. Imagine doing this on the Ethereum network, and as I mentioned, it's multi-chain. So you can do this on a ton of different networks. And now you can see my order from 500 DAI to 0 0.5 Ethereum. That would be a steal. You can see it expires, all of that great stuff. I just placed my first order. Now we could do a limit sell. So limit sell is essentially the same thing, but on the sell side. If X, so if Ethereum reaches Y, so if Ethereum reaches you know, $10,000, I wanna sell that. So let's go max amount of Ethereum. We wanna change this to DAI and let's go $10,000. So, or that's $100,000. You know what, let's leave it at $100,000. So my 0 0.1 will get me $10,000, 10% of the whole cost of one Ethereum. I need to approve ETH here, uh, very normal. And then I can actually proceed with this transaction. So as soon as ETH reaches $100,000 before Bitcoin does, um, I will sell this 0 0.1 and earn 10,000 DAI. So pretty neat, eh? With these limit buys and limit sells, there's so much you could do. Um, and then I'll show you guys what to do with the stop loss. I'll do that with some BNB because I used all of my Ethereum here. Now we have two orders opened. We have the limit buy. So as soon as ETH drops, we have our both sides covered. If Ethereum drops a thousand, we're buying. If Ethereum goes to hundred thousand, we're selling. Now let's do a stop loss. So markets are moving so quick, so volatile, and you can't be on, you know, watching the graph all the time. What if you bought Ethereum at four thousand 
and you don't want to hold that position if it drops. So you can have a stop loss at 3,700, 3,600, 3,500. So if it hits that price, you automatically sell. I'll show you guys an example. We're gonna do it with BNB. We have 0.1 BNB, let's say, that is worth $46. The price of BNB is 377. Let's say if it goes to 299, I want out. Okay, because I want to reposition, you know, I want to put my money somewhere else. I don't want to hold on to a losing asset. So 0 0.1, if it falls down to $299, I am going to sell my BNB. So now you can see I have three different orders, the limit buy, the limit sell, and the stop loss. They have buy with fiat, they have limit order old, stop loss old, but I showed you guys how to do it with the new um but I showed you guys how to do it here, so no point to go to these. And then we can move on to the sniper, which is like what I, this is how I found bogged finance because of the two launches yesterday. So if we go into the sniper details, be the first to purchase new listings. That's what happened yesterday to me. I totally missed out on these huge gains. Look at that. And then look at this right here. So. If we go back to the sniper, as an exclusive bogged finance trading tool, you must hold 7,500 bog in your wallet to use a sniper. Staked LP in bog does not count towards your holding for to access this tool, so you just have to hold it, you can't stake it. The sniper tool provides the following features. Access to mempool sniping, transaction spam mode, 99% fee avoidance, to transaction limit bypass, trading pause avoidance. Read more about the ultimate sniper and its features here, and then to to actually buy the tokens you need to come here you'll come back to the dex aggregator um, and then let's take a look at how much the bog actually cost so if you wanted to buy the sniper i'm gonna actually heavily no we need to do 7500 bog let me put this to die um, so we can see how much this will cost us this will cost us $5,600. I've had so many people come to me, how do we build bots? How do we build sniper bots? It'll cost you probably so much more unless you know how to code or you have you know a good resource. It'll probably cost you more than this. And just as I mentioned yesterday, I saw somebody clear 50 BNB with this one launch. So if you're dedicated to these launches and finding out when these tokens, popular tokens are launching on different networks, you can actually make your money back maybe one time, two times, and then it's total profit. You're still holding the coin. You can sell it whenever you want. So this sniper, I don't have, have it of, as of yet. I literally stumbled on Bog Finance yesterday and I'm like, so many people are asking about limit orders, stop losses, and this is like an awesome tool. It's very clean, very easy to use. Um, and let's just go and check if our third, uh, awesome. So our stop loss did get added. And then I am gonna get the sniper tool bot. I am gonna buy the 7,500 bog. As of yet, I'm not gonna pull the trigger. I'm gonna take a look at bog pricing. I'm gonna do some charting. And I'm gonna just make sure that um, I'm gonna actually use it because I'm gone for the next two weeks. I'm still gonna be doing daily videos, but I just wanna make sure that I pay back the 7,500 bog, that I recover my capital as soon as possible. So if I see another launch and it's you know in the next day or two, maybe that's when I'll buy the bog. I'm not in a rush right now they have staking as well where you can stake your bog token so the governance token you can actually bridge as well from different networks and then they have nfts charts portfolio tracking all that great stuff i, I use dex tools for charting it's a little bit more clearer than this you have a little bit more tools and then you can actually use your portfolio tracker as well right here um, and add your assets so if i connect my wallet um, you can see everything right here Awesome. So you can see everything right here, all of my tokens, my worst performer, my best performer, and all of that great stuff. So if you have any questions about bogged finance, you know, how to set up limit orders, how to use the sniper bot, I'm going to take a deeper look into that. Post below, hit the like button, smash the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.